Yo, my beautiful people, today I bring you my first of many Marvel Avengers videos. And well, let's just straight up state, I love the game, it's incredible and it's a game I will be adding into my arsenal of games to cover on my channel. Don't stress, BR3 and D2 ain't going anywhere. But yeah, today in my first video I bring you this amazingly helpful farm which will see you gain XP, upgrade modules, units and much much more super quickly. So how's it going guys, my name's DPJ and if you enjoy your stay here and would like to show your support, hitting that like button truly helps out and subscribe if you do want to see more. Also, because this game is new, I will be giving you guys a chance to win a copy. Any platform you want, all you have to do is like this video and leave a comment down below with the platform you play on. I will pick winners in a few days and announce them on my videos. Okay, so it's really early days into this game. Newcomers as of right now won't know much about materials needed to progress in terms of upgrading gear and buying items. But if you are at this stage, then this video is perfect for you. What I will show you is an amazing mission you come across within a campaign that you can farm and get unlimited XP, upgrade modules, units and you even sometimes get gear pieces and other resources too. XP is obviously needed to level up your Avenger, upgrade modules are used to purchase high powered gear from vendors and units are used with certain vendors to buy certain cosmetics, vendors such as Chastity McBride, but I'm sure you guys know this already. But when you are an early starter, these resources ain't as common as you might think. Well, this farm kind of changes that. Now, I will state, I found this at a stage in the game where I 100% know it works, but there could be many other instances earlier or even later on in the campaign where this same farm can be done, and maybe even be done much more efficiently, making it quicker on yourself. So the campaign mission I was doing this on is called Breakout. Like I said, this is a campaign mission and you get here around at 25% campaign complete mark. This kind of farm though in reality can be done on any mission, it's just finding the items to farm. This mission I know guarantees upgrade modules, units and other resources. You can also use any Avenger you have unlocked to do this by simply switching to them before starting the mission. So if you want to get gear pieces on a certain Avenger because he's low, you can do that. So once the mission has started up, skip all the cinematics as you don't want to keep watching them. So once you are in the mission, you need to follow the route I take, basically a direct path to progress. Now all resources en route to the place to farm can be farmed, so any crates you see, chests you find or anything else for that matter can be farmed here. So you first come to this part of the mission where you have to beat down a few baddies to progress. Here on Hulk or Miss Marvel, you can break down this wall. At the stage I'm at with Iron Man right now, he can't yet break down walls. So breaking down this wall you open a chest which guarantees you 30 units and sometimes other things, but this isn't the goodie box people. So take down all these enemies here and progress. You then get to progress into this room which is kind of straightforward. Shoot the yellow light right in front of you, then jump up to the left, jump up to the right, pull out these enclosed battery thingies and smash them both up. What do we do? If you destroy the two transformers on the upper level, the elevator door should open. Then progress to the main farming part. Here there's a simple puzzle you need to complete to open this door and grab that chest. Within this area there are four fans you have to break and I believe they need to be done in a certain order, the order I do them on screen now. Worth opening if you can activate the unlock sequence. Careful, might be a trap. Once 
you have broken the fans, with your Avengers range attacks, the doors will open. So go to that door and grab this chest. Now this chest guarantees 50 units and an upgrade module every single time. It also commonly gives you gear, gear which is most of the time higher than that gear you already have. And from this moment people it's pretty simple. Press start, return to Quinjet and from there to simply start the mission, rinse and repeat. All resources which you just collected will be there for you to collect again. And while you are doing this people, you earn crazy amounts of XP and gain Avenger levels and faction levels too if you do have them faction bounties on you, which also give you upgrade modules, gear and much much more as long as you are completing them while doing this mission. You will at the same time earn a ton of gear doing this, gear which you can dismantle and get even more resources back. So it's a win 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 for sure. So you guys enjoy this while you can, the reason it works is because the checkpoint is void when you quit the mission. So this kind of farm right now probably won't be here for long, so make the most out of it while you can. Now like I said this kind of farm can be done on any mission where you find anything useful. Simply grab it, quit out, load back up the mission, rinse and repeat. And again like I said before this stage of the campaign or even much further after. Find something decent near the start of a mission, grab that loot, quit out, load it back up, rinse and repeat and you are good to go. And guys, on that note, we have come to the end of the video and I truly do hope it helps you out and you find the video useful. If it did, leaving a like really helps me out. If you're new around here and you want to see more Avengers, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video I upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on that next one.